Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. So today's video is going to be a hair video, a hair show and tell, really quick video, hopefully it'll be quite quick. I get questions on this hair and how I style it, how I maintain it and everything, where it's from, all that good stuff. So I thought I'd share with you in this video. So this hair is from Beauty Forever Hair and I've got four bundles of 26 inches. I wanted to go long because I initially got um, shorter bundles but they just didn't look right. I wanted like really long when obviously when I brush them out it still you know kept that length four bundles of 26 you do not need four bundles let me tell you this hair is quite full it's very very full um, especially when you obviously when you brush it out and everything you loosen the curls it's gonna get big I'm gonna show you in this video of me brushing out the hair it's huge it gets very huge but if you're not if you're not about the big hair life then maybe stick to three so I have a 20 inch frontal the frontal I found was the curl pattern was a little bit looser, like from the roots, I guess, to like probably like an inch or this wide, you know, a little bit looser. So when you put them together, you do see a slight difference in the curl pattern. But once you brush this out, it kind of blends anyway. This hair, this wig, I'll probably say it's like low maintenance. When you do brush out the hair though, to obviously when you're applying your products, whatever, you would get a little bit of, you know, fall out, a little bit of hair on your brush or your comb. This is what I use to comb out the hair. I don't use a paddle brush because obviously that's just gonna get really, really big and just gonna ruin the curl pattern. So I would use this and I wet the hair once and it has reverted back to the curl pattern. So what people usually do is just to use water to, you know, to, you know, to moisturize and to get the hair all hydrated and stuff. So what I did at first was to put some water and obviously apply water all over the hair and then brushed it out. But obviously I don't, I don't want to have that wet feel where my hair is dripping wet so I was kind of thinking of what other way or what other products could I use to kind of keep that wet look but not have the hair actually wet. I use the Wella Shock Waves. If you remember my wet hair or wet look makeup tutorial, I showed you this product and because I already had it in my, in my, you know, my house. I thought let me use it but yeah this is for curls and waves and it defines curls and waves so it's like a mousse think about this mousse though I feel like this is the third one I've gotten since that video because I feel like after a while it doesn't come out as a mousse it comes out like liquid and it's like I feel like it's <laughs> been ruined I feel like it's it's run out but it's like there's a lot of but there's a lot of product in it if you do have something else that you use that isn't water that still gives that wet hair look let me know. The thing about this one is, as well is that after you've applied it, it does stay wet down for a while and it dries up. So right now it's dry. So it says shake it, let me shake it. Just run it to the hair. And this will obviously make the hair look wet. But yeah, let me just bring the rest of the hair just to show you how much hair you get you get quite a lot of hair you get quite a lot of hair so um, and obviously if you brush it even more you can you can probably get the hair a lot bigger than, you probably get the hair a lot bigger than this if you do brush it out even more so literally all I do is run it through the hair make sure you get every part because you can you know miss out some bits of hair push it the back so you can part this hair wherever you want either a middle part or a side part I feel like for me I think this hair is more flattering as a side part for me but I have tried it as a middle part again it is quite big it's very Ciara vibe which obviously I'm not mad at and then I have this product which is the Cantu Shea Butter for natural hair moisturizing curl activator cream it says apply this with your, when your hair is damp so I literally just apply this straight on because the smell of this isn't so, it's not bad, but it's not the best. So this has a gorgeous shea butter smell. So I apply some of that, oh, it smells so nice, onto the hair, coating the hair entirely. Make sure you get the ends as well of the hair. Don't forget the ends. So yeah, this helps to kind of keep the hair shiny you know so it's still it's not like dripping wet but still keeps that shine the same on this side as well I 
this alone does give that wet look but it does dry after a while and it does have a bit of a hold so i tend to then add this just to give it a bit more moisture and obviously a really nice smell to the hair as well and so far the hair has kept really well i store it on a mannequin because obviously it can get tangled it can get messy so i i put it on a mannequin head and i don't sleep with it because i feel like if i sleep with it the curls will get ruined so i don't sleep with this wig and it's just it's so big like it's just far too hot to sleep in this wig anyway and i don't usually sleep in my wigs anyways i feel like their bundles are quite generous honestly so you honestly don't need four bundles but I just wanted that full look and after a while I will eventually brush the entire thing out and just have it like a nice loose wave. Shipping took a few days, um, it was definitely under a week, a few days which is pretty good. If you are interested in this hair definitely check my description box and I'm going to have all the information, you know the link to the hair, they've also got bundle deals as well as you know with a frontal or a closure, I don't use closures anymore so I just use frontals and um, it's honestly I love it I absolutely love it if you want I don't know if you want like styling videos how I style this hair I feel like there are a couple ways I can style the hair maybe if you want me to do that let me know I'll do that in a separate video but um, that's pretty much it for this video like I feel like there isn't much to say on this hair just make sure that you okay so make sure that you moisturize and coat the hair with you know a conditioner frequently because it can dry out it can get dry and frizzy which you don't want especially at the ends Make sure when you apply the products, you're putting it on every part of the hair, not just the top or the side. Coat the entire hair. And honestly, it's gonna look so healthy. I love it. I love it. I'm gonna have a lot of wigs chaining up. And I'm gonna be showing you how to color some hair as well. Um, there's a wig that I, I've worn recently and I'm gonna show you how to color it and stuff like that. So yeah, I am bringing back my hair videos. Yay, yay. So yeah, anyway, that's it for the video. Thank you so much for watching. I have somewhere to be. I am off out on a date night so um gonna go look cute so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next one bye guys